All right, give me another look at the system out here towards the plains right now. It's bringing showers and storms to much of the area, but this system will be tracking its way eastwards in the coming 24 hours. And by this time tomorrow night, it will be upon us, bringing us that chance for some showers in a few storms to our area. But for overnight hours tonight, looking at a nice night of temperatures dropping down to actually 61 degrees by tomorrow morning, according to the latest model run. With those temperatures again, raining on the mild side into tomorrow morning and overnight lows again, Roughly in the 60s for pretty much everyone headed into Friday morning. And for tomorrow, looking at a solid nice day with just the increase in cloud cover, especially during the afternoon and evening hours, with just a slight chance of a storm by the time we get to late Friday evening and headed towards Friday night. But overall, looking at a nice day with those winds turning to the south as a warm front will be working its way in here early in the day on Friday, sending those temperatures well up into the 80s as well. Look at this, temperatures from 81 to 87 degrees by the end of the day tomorrow. So looking at a solid, beautiful day for your Friday, a tad more humid, but as we head towards Friday night, though, we do have some severe weather to talk about, mainly from Illinois looking at just some severe threat for some storms for them. But for us looking at just some showers and some storms with the main threats being heavy rain and some lightning of any storms Friday night and going into Saturday morning. But for Saturday afternoon into Saturday night, a different story, damaging winds with the storms that come in here Saturday night as well as a level worn marginal risk for severe weather. So lower end threat for some strong storms, which means that will storm or two could turn severe with that being the case again. That's hence why we do have that damaging wind threat in the area for Saturday afternoon and headed towards Saturday evening. Now jumping ahead to future forecast starting off of tomorrow morning noticing the clouds a couple of clouds in our area to begin Friday but we will stay relatively nice and dry as we progress throughout the course of the day on Friday. We stay mainly dry until about sunset when those shower chances really creep in here by Friday evening and headed into early Saturday morning. Look at this by Saturday morning looking at some scattered showers and some storms moving in here. There are about seven 30 in the morning. That'll be the first round of storms as it will slide in here by about the noon to one o'clock hour. And then we get a bit of a break from the action before a cold front will come in here Saturday evening. And that'll bring us another chance for maybe a couple isolated storms along that front. And again, any storms that do form along that front could turn severe as with that margin risk of severe weather in place, there is some energy. There could be some energy in the atmosphere for this to actually lead to those storms turning severe as according to the models, they do show that we could have some energy especially around 1500 joules of cape, which is actually marginal for severe weather to actually take place. And with that being the case, we could see again, maybe a strong storm or two later Saturday afternoon and into Saturday evening before this front sweeps through the area later on Saturday evening into Saturday night. So looking at just again, slight chance of a storm. And with the rainfall, looking at roughly about, I would say actually half inch of rainfall to as much as a inch of rainfall. This model seems to be um, actually this is actually very much misleading, but I do think we'll have a half inch of rainfall to as much as maybe an inch of rainfall by this time Saturday night. So looking at quite a bit of rain coming your way, but then after that, it's back to some sunshine for Sunday afternoon. And again, looking at those beautiful temperatures continuing into Monday, 78 Monday, 88 on Tuesday, and then storms likely Wednesday into Thursday with those temperatures back up to near 90 by the following Sunday.